Hello everyone, it's me, McMiner, and welcome back to another episode of FNAF Shopping. And in today's episode, we're going to be stopping by a bunch of different stores to see to see what we can find. Including this Walmart right here. This is our, going to be our first stop. We're going to be stopping by two Walmarts, three GameStops, and one Hot Topic just to see what we can find. So yeah, I will see you inside. Alright, we made it to the toy area. Let's see what we can find starting in this aisle. It's probably nothing here, considering this looks like the board game area. Okay. Looks like this is where they would be. Oh, here's some piggy stuff. And not for these action figures, but yeah, they move some stuff. But yeah. All they have is a couple of memory plushies, looks like. And a couple, and a few live wire freddies I actually figure. Oh, there's a high school chica and another high school chica. And both of these are live wire freddies as well. So yeah. Expected that there is nothing here. They sold out on all those Liberty Chica and live wire freddy plushies really quickly. Cause it's been about two weeks. Cause it's been about two weeks since I found Liberty Chica at this Walmart. So yeah, that's that just shows how quickly exclusive plushies sell out. So yeah, there is a couple Minecraft plushies here too. So yeah, like Steve and the Goat. But yeah. Doesn't look like there's anything here. So I will be back with you at the next location. Right, so we are at our first GameStop and did I say did I say three GameStops? If so, I lied, I meant five. So let's see what they have here. Okay. Oh, they have an officer doggy. Hmm. Oh they have some of the Security breach, the soft security breach stuff. They have a high score chica, they have a jackal bunny. What's this action figure back here? Okay, it's a radioactive foxy. Yeah, they have some action figures here as well. Stuff. And yeah, I forgot to mention, GameStop now sells these. So if you're looking for these, try searching at your local GameStop. But yeah, doesn't look like there's anything interesting here, so I'll be back with you guys at another location. Alright, so we are at our second GameStop now. See if they have anything cool. Pretty much. Yeah. It doesn't look like there's anything here, which is expected because I've been to this game store before many times and they never had interest anything interesting in my opinion. So yeah. It doesn't yeah, they don't have anything interesting here, so I'll be back with you guys in another location. All right, we are at our third GameStop. Let's see what they have. Oh, they have a system Erevani here. <laughs> yeah, well, they have a bunch of gaming stuff. Like, oh, they have this guy. He looks familiar. Oh, they. They also have Sammy Lawrence. Yeah. Oh, they have some piggy stuff over here. Here's some. Oh, wait. oh yeah, these are. Oh, no, she's. 
Just an Among Us character. Yeah, I only have another Sammy back there. And let's see. Let's see. Yeah, doesn't look like we have anything here as well, so I'll see you all in another location. Alrighty, we are in our second Walmart. So, let's see what they have, if anything. Okay. Nothing here. Yeah, let's see if they have anything over in this area. Nope, nothing. Probably be over here. Okay, this is where all the Hot Wheels stuff is. So, yeah. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, it doesn't look like they have anything here. Yeah. they have is some Minecraft and some Mario stuff. But yeah, oh, this is where the FNAF stuff would be. So they have some Livewire for the action figures and some Captain Foxy or a Captain Foxy. Oh, what's this down here? Oh, it's a Jack Obani action figure. But yeah. Oh, and some a VR Freddy and some more live wire Freddy action figures, but yeah, nothing here. So, see you in another location. Alrighty, we are now in Hot Topic. Yep, there's the Bonnie again. Ooh! Oh my god, they have the actual exclusives this time. Like, they have Freddy and Chica. Okay, I might be purchasing both of these guys. So, yeah. I will see you soon. Alright, so as I was getting in line to pay for these guys, I just saw to my right, they have some of the tie-dye pocket pops here as well. So, if, you're, look, if you want the pocket pops, they should be available at your local Hot Topic. So, yeah, I will be back with you once I pay for these guys, and I thought I'd just like to let you all know. So yeah, see you then. <laughs> Alright, there they are in there. And so, yeah. And, oh, there is some huggy wuggy stuff in there. So, yeah, we'll be off to our second to last location. And yeah, we will see you then. Alright, we are in our fourth out of five game stops. So, let's see what they have. Oh, I thought that was a FNAF pocket pop right there, like, right here, and why has it been open? I don't know. Some piggy stuff over here, and oh, a uh, high score Chica action figure, and yeah, more piggy stuff, and speaking of pigs, there's some Minecraft piggies, oink oink. Yeah, more memories, more Sammies. And yeah. Oh, there's some more Mario stuff. And what's down here? Oh, nothing. Yeah. Oh. This pop is backwards. So. Yeah. If they have anything interesting here, so we'll be back with you at one more location. We'll be back with you at our final game stop. All right, guys. As you can see, there's some more pocket pops in this location because 
I lied. This is not my. This is not the last GameStop. This is actually box lunch. I found the Pocket Pops, and I found two of the new tie dye plushies. I found Foxy and Bonnie. So yeah, I might be getting these two. I'm not making any promises, but yeah. I will be back with you once I do. All right, guys, I did not purchase any of those tie-dye plushies because, well, I, from, like, we talked to the cashiers and they said that they were like a sister location to Hot Topic. So that's why they were pretty expensive. They were about $16.90 each. So it would have cost me about $34 to get both of those plushies. I mean, don't get me wrong, that's a little, that, don't get me wrong, that's how much, that's almost how much I paid for the, these two guys back over here. It's just that I prefer to save money on them, and we saw on Funko's website that they're going to be about $12 when they release, so I'm going to be trying to save money and all that. And besides, the regular tie-dye plushies are like my number one thing on my Christmas wish list this year, so I think it'll be worth the wait for when they do come out but yeah but hey if you're looking for them try box lunch because i found them at box lunch just now so yeah anyways i will be back with you all at our final game stop all right we are at our last game stop for the day and i already i already see some fnaf ar plushies like they have oh well, they have all four of them here we have Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy. Uh, yeah, that is very interesting. Yeah, let's see if they have anything else. Whoa, they have a lot of the mystery minis and action figures. First time I've seen Toxic Springtrap's action figure in a while. Oh, and they have some of the Pizzeria Simulator. Assuming it's in the pre-release versions again, because like I said before, or I might have put that in a video, but these are not the GameStop exclusives, unfortunately. You have to go to eBay for those now. So yeah, and they have some of the slime things. And, oh, some piggy stuff. And, hmm. See what they have over here. Uh, just a bunch of Mario and Pokemon stuff. Okay. okay. Oh, they have the Jumbo Black. They have a couple of the Jumbo Blacklight Vannies here. That is very cool. And like I said before, because they made the Blacklight Security Breach plushies a Hot Topic exclusives, I might get a softer Vanny. And make a custom and make this exact plushie like using paint and just paint it in this exact color in these exact colors so yeah so yeah it doesn't look like they have anything new here because as you might or might not know i already have all of these guys so yeah dang they have four bonnies and then they have a Freddy, a Chica, and a Foxy. What's back here? Nothing. Okay. So, yeah. I will be back with you when we get back home. Alright, everyone. We're back home. So, time to show you what we got in today's FNAF shopping video. So, we got the bag here. And we were able to find two of the inverted Five Nights at Freddy's AR plushies. So we found the inverted VR Freddy and the inverted High Squad Chica. Now if I come over here, I can grab my normal VR Freddy and High Squad Chica to put next to, to put next to each other. And, oh, you know what? Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna take all my regular FNAF AR plushies, line them up like this, and then put the inverted versions in front of their normal counterparts. So yeah, now it's just the hunt for the inverted Bonnie and Foxy, which I wasn't able to find, unfortunately, at Hot Topic today. But I do plan on finding them. I do plan on trying to find them soon. But because I have a coupon that lasts from September 15th to the 25th, I'll be trying again 
on the 15th. See if I can find the inverted Bonnie and Foxy. And yeah, that will be that will be the plan. I will be trying again in a few weeks to try to find Bonnie and Foxy because that will be part two because part two doesn't really exist just yet. Yeah, I haven't made the video or anything, so yeah. I will be doing I'll be attempting to make part two in a couple weeks where I in a few weeks where I try to find Bonnie and Foxy, their inverted versions. And yeah. That's the plan, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, and if you haven't already, consider subscribing and ringing the bell for updates on new videos, because you won't want to miss the video where I find Inverted Bonnie and Foxy. Because once I do find them, I'll be able to record my final part of the FNAF AR plushie review. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. See you guys. Woohoo!